What's the chow chin chows? Just be it's games here. Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Zeta Randomized Bravery Run Challenge. In the last episode, we made it right here to uh, this town. I can't remember the name off the top of my head. Let's walk it back in and out of the Pokedex, uh, the Pokemon Center, so we can get it. So we are at Kansas Town, which is sort of a sort of middle road town on Mount uh, on the mountain we are on. And hopefully today we are going to actually continue on and get to uh, the big town with the ice type gym, hopefully. That is the plan, to get to the big town with the ice type gym. I'm a little worried about the ice type gym because don't we have a lot of coverage for ice type apes as I've shown? LOD Alga. I'm just going to run. Wait, I can't run. <laughs> I actually have to kill this. I keep on forgetting this is a bra- Like, I go into these uh, go into these recordings without remembering this is a bravery run. Like, I go in and just say, I'm going to play some Zeta and I'm going to be happy about it. Especially since I need to actually record some Zeta because I haven't sure actually recorded some Zeta yet. So, you know, that happens sometimes. But the fact is, I never remember that this is a bravery run. That's the whole problem with this challenge. I never remember that- it that this even exists as a bravery run. What? What do I do with the Alga, actually? Because the Alga is a uh, ground dragon. And you have Roar of Time. Damn it. Well, it's a good thing I'm like... I guess I need to go running back to the Pokemon Center already and I'm already five minutes into this episode because of... Hello, the Alga. Yes, the Alga must recharge, which means, in other words, I can get off an Earthquake, which means this day Alga will die. There we go. Okay. Scary Pokemon. Avoid it. Scary Pokemon down. Now. Let me put on a Repel so I can get on it back to the Pokemon Center because I just lost another... I just lost Ninetales. Do I actually even have repels? Please say I have repels. Please say I have repel. I don't have. I actually really didn't buy repels. I have not bought repels. Let's go and do that. Let's go and heal up my mons and let's go and buy repels because that could get annoying after a while. Oh my god. Yard Pokemon are annoying. Sometimes, like I don't mind cat. I don't mind killing off like one or two Pokemon, but legendaries are always scary. They're always scary. It's really hard to deal with when you're like five minutes into an episode and you're trying to get things done, and then you actually run into a legendary and like you can't get things done. I can't get things done when that happens. Now, do I have rep super repels? Uh, I do. Why did I not see the fact that I had nine super repels? Right. Back. This is this is one of the annoying things about this game. Like in fifth gen, you could organize your items. This game, you cannot. There we go. Okay. I'm going to have to sort out my bag and see if I can move things up and down with a select button like I could do in previous games. That's what I have to do. Anyway, so how are you guys all doing? Let me know. Um, for me, I've just... Uh, well, actually... Uh, a couple of days ago, I went on a singles night back in Chester, and uh, back in my hometown. It was actually not bad. I can't really tell you too much about it because I'd like to keep my... Uh, uh, the people I met there, confidentialities and stuff like that. But, like, it was actually not bad. It was not about dating or anything like that. It was about socialising and meeting fellow singletons. And that's something I don't have a lot of. I don't have a lot of, like, single friends. I don't really have a lot of friends, period, outside of YouTube. So, you know, it's actually really good to get friends like that. So I actually really enjoyed it. It's not... It was an interesting thing to do. I'm not saying that I'm going to... I just found TM90 and TM91. I don't know if I'm going to go again. I'm, I'm probably going to go again. But, like, I don't know if there's any of the uh, uh, girls I found interesting enough that I would actually date. I mean, 
I need a bit more information. I've spent like all of a couple of hours with these people before I would actually even, you know, said anything to them. So the fact is, I really don't know too much about them. And I really feel like if I'm going to ever find my, if I'm ever going to find a girlfriend, I'm going to need to find, oh my God, why? 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 Why is she a cold? God damn it. I bring in the Pokemon to deal with you, and then you shield cold. Now I have to tail glow. I have to tail glow now. Thanks a load. You just made you just made me have to sweep you. You made me have to sweep you. Okay, now okay, my special attack won't go any higher. And you've used Safeguard like three times, which allowed me to get up the, uh, my special attack so I could actually sweep you. So I'm going to now sweep... Oh my god! Me being plus six doesn't even kill you! Die! That's what you get for one hit KOing my Pokemon! I hate Sheer Colt. I really do! This was going to be a fun battle. Now you're a very dead person because I had to go and... I had to go and get, you know, plus six on your bottom to to get you. I had to go and do this. You didn't have to make me do this, you know. You could have just ha allowed me to uh, not, you know, have to deal with this. But now I have to deal with this. All because of one sheer cold. These mons now have to die the most violent of deaths. And it also got me off about talking about what I was... Oh, wait, you have a shadow. You have a shadow. You have a shadow Medicham. Well, I guess go quick ball. Come on. No. Okay, you don't like the quick ball idea. Okay. Can I actually... I don't think I can hurt this. Because if I... Because I'm plus six right now. And he made me get this way because of that Lapras. Okay. I'm going to have to... Uh, oh, wait. You're on a timer. You're on a timer. I don't have time to play... I don't have time to play around with switching. I don't have time. Right, I don't have time to play around with switching. You either come with me or you die eventually. Because I'm just going to have to... I just have to go get... I have to try and get you. Immediately. You're going to die. You're going to die. I'm going... I'm going to have to keep on throwing balls at this thing. Because I'm not so sure I'm going to catch it. I know I have a master ball there, but I'd like to keep that. I don't want to waste it on uh, like a meta cham. I would like to waste. I would like to waste that on something. I don't know. Good. And I'm not saying meta cham is not good. Just saying that, like, I mean, in a couple episodes, I'm gonna be catching Wakwaza. It looks like that's something that might be happening. There we go. We caught the meta cham. Okay, so it looks it looks like in a couple of episodes time I'm going to be catching uh, Rayquaza, and I'd much rather have a uh, a specialist ball like the Master Ball in order to deal with Rayquaza than actually have something that doesn't you know just normal balls because Rayquaza is going to be scary to deal with. What's this item? Hey, it's another TM. Wow, I just got like, three TMs in a row. Skydrop, Flash Cannon, Substitute. I mean, I don't think I'm going to be using any... I might use Flash Cannon. Flash Cannon's not a bad TM. For a steel, for a special Steel-type move, it's actually not bad. Yeah, Flash Cannon's not a bad move. Can you, like, move, please? Hello? There you go. No, 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 you need to move again. Thank you. Okay. People just get in my way. It's not cool. There. Oh. Hello. 
I confess that I, I confess I heard that Cypher is sending an agent to snag a weapon from Brandon. He's trying to take down the king, hmm? And where is the king? He disappeared a month ago. Cypher experts uh, Cypher expert exploits him to await there um, in ki at Kingdom of City. Cypher expects him to wait. Cypher expects him to await them at Kingdom City. They expect you to use Shadow Requaser to defeat him, I would think. Yes, that's what they expect. What is actually going to happen is not that at all. Garivo isn't exactly a master ball uh, battler himself, so. He's asking you to do his dirty work. Yes, he is. I wonder, though, would you pose a challenge to the king? In even a Shadow Equazer, I simply don't think you could. Even defeat me. Prove it. Prove you can uh, become the true master of Shadow Equazer. Okay. Oh, it's Suze Rain! Hello, Suze... Right. Hello, Suze Rain again. You know, I'm... You know, I'm gonna keep on saying that you've made a good game here, Suze Rain. You've made yourself some god-tier trainer, even with the randomizer on, because you have a Jirachi. But, you know, you've made... This is a good game. I really like your game. I'm gonna flamethrower you now, though. Is that going to kill? Oh, it goes in about half. But it burns. It burns. That's good. That's a start. But now your special defense. But I think even with the burn, I think I'm going to kill you now anyway. Yeah, I'm going to kill you. That's one. And it's all because I got that burn. You trying to cosmic power and you trying to save yourself, but you ain't going to save yourself. A Whalmer. Okay, so I took the future sight attack. I'm okay with that. I should switch into Jake here. Because I actually forgot to heal after that darn battle with uh, Lapras. I got to heal. I forgot to heal after that. Oh, this is a Life Orb Whalmer. Okay. That's actually some power. It's some dead power, but it's some power. It's some dead power because it couldn't just, it couldn't live a leaf blade. It wasn't that bad though. And a fly gone. Okay, that's a shadow. That is a shadow. Whoa. Um Jake, would you mind not doing that? Oh no! Oh, damn it! Well, never mind about the shadow fly gone. Because I couldn't catch that if I couldn't catch that even if I wanted to. Because I crit it. I crit it, and it put itself in hyper mode. That's not exactly what I wanted. It crit and it put itself in hyper mode. So there's no, there was nothing I could do about that. That was completely random. I'm sorry to those people who wanted me to catch the Shadow Flygon. That is not going to happen. Sadly, because it decided to kill itself. Although I crit it, but like I can't be blamed for that because I didn't know it was going to crit. I can't be blamed for that, because I did not know that, that was going to happen. You're a dugong now. Ooh. If you use Ice Beam, I'm dead. Okay. You didn't use Ice Beam. I can get Jake in, and Jake can uh, Leaf Blade, and that's possibly... Oh, you are tanky. And you do get an Ice Beam off. Damn. I didn't think you were that tanky. But 
it does put me into a place where if I can find something that's faster than you, you will die. So I'm hoping that Firefox is faster than you and they can hit you with Psy Shock. And it is. Cool. And your final mon? Alakazam. Well, catch this dark matter. Oh, you're faster than... Never mind. You're faster than me. Go, String. Uh, String. Um, I think it'd be better to use Crunch in this situation. I would love to use Zombie Strike, but I'm pretty sure Zombie Strike has a high chance of miss. And I do want a one-shot. Nice. Yes, I would be able to master a quasar. I do have a master ball too. It seems that as if I was correct. You are a powerful trainer. Very well. Continue up Mount Epsilon. Encounter Brendan at its peak. Go save the world as your as you heroes do. I do think I'll be seeing you again. I just so hope it isn't an obituary. I'll be fine. Don't worry about me. If like if it's going to be an obituary, you're writing it, Zeus Rain. I'm going to have to heal every one of my mons so everyone is alive. And now I have to... Uh, it's a good thing I bought potions in the last episode. Yeah, because I have hyper potions here. It's a good thing I bought potions off screen in between episodes. If I didn't buy potions, oh my god, if I didn't buy potions. There we go. Everyone is back at full health. And uh, I'm glad in 4th gen, uh, uh, well, 4th and 5th gen and 6th gen a bit, that hyper potions are 200. And that's good. Okay, so we're going to be going outside now, which means, in other words, I'm going to be running into people, which is great. Because I've had a lot of... Oh my god, why? I'm just going to swords dance. I'm just going to swords dance. Just let me get to plus six. Just let me get to plus six. I am not ca I'm not dealing with a Wobba Fett. I am not dealing with a Wobba Fett today. Not today. Not any day. I am going to plus six. I am definitely going to plus six. Now, if you want to swords... If you're going to Destiny Bond, I'm definitely going to uh, plus six. And now I'm going to cross Scissor. You're going to die, and I'm not going to die with you. There we go. Okay. Okay. That was scary. Again, I hate war effects. And now I'm just going to destroy you. Aerial Ace, die. Because you let, you had to leave with a Wobbuffet. You had to make me had to do this. Like you had to make me have to destroy you. Jake, do, Jake is fine with destroying things. Oh, you have a Lily Pop. I like Lily Pop. I like Lily Pop. It's a good Pokemon. It evolves into one of my favourite Pokemon in Scoutland. And in, if you don't know my relationship with Scoutland, watch, watch Pokemon Black. Yorkshire was amazing. And a Pupitar. I like Pupitar too. That should be a T-Tar by now though. Just want to mention that. That should be a T-Tar by now. You didn't have to crit him there, Jake. You're plus six. And finally... I need a ran... I need a ran... Male. So that's fine. There we go. There we go. Okay. I hate people who do that. I hate people... Uh, I hate the randomizer for doing that. I really do. What do you have, then? You start with some waddle. I like some waddle. Some waddle's not bad. You know, some waddle's a good Pokemon. You can start with some waddle and lead, uh, learn to lead on with something good like that. It evolves into Lily Gallons. Lily Vet 
Lily Garen is one of the gra is a very good fifth turn grass type. Ooh, Magmortar. Okay. And on that, we switch. Go, Aqua. Ooh, he's trying to use, he's trying to use strats against me. He is trying to use strats against me. He's trying to sunny day solar beam. If he actually has solar beam, I will be really annoyed. Oh my god, I do I do literally no damage to you now that you got the sunny day up. Okay, I'm gonna I'm just gonna like not do um, water type moves anymore. That's a gleam. I have other moves. I'm not afraid to use them. Wow! You switch into a gulpin on the time where I'm about to actually use a fairy type move. That is tactics. I don't like that. I really don't like the fact that you just use tactics against me. I'm going to ice beam instead then. Because I have other moves and I'm not afraid to use them. It's just I'm really annoyed that you've decided to switch out into something on the turn that I was going to use a fairy type move on you. That's really annoying. You played you played me. You played the game. You played the game and I don't like that. Volbeat. Okay, the sunlight's faded. I'm totally fine with the sunlight fading because I can deal I can start deal with all oh, the freeze. The freeze! That is beautiful! Okay. I guess some... Oh, yeah. Okay, two turns. That's fine. Die. There we go. Okay, so now you're going to bring in back Magmortar again, and I can now kill it because there's no sunlight up. And I definitely outspeed. And you're not living one turn. You're not living one turn. Not enough turns for you to get off the sun. That's what you live. No turns. Level 65 for Aqua. Aqua is like a front runner at this moment in time. I know I shouldn't be using front. I know I shouldn't be using him because he's too OP. Because he's darn legendary, but and everything. But he's awesome. Leave him be. I think I've got like one more battle left before we uh, head up this uh, rock climbing bit. It might be uh, where we need to go. It might not be where we need to go. I might be wrong in thinking that I need to go up here, but I'm guessing I need to go up here. I didn't see anywhere else I needed to go. I didn't see an next staircase. If only I had things that dealt with travel. I wasn't trying to uh, d wasn't trying to uh, get people up to levels. Okay. Uh, can I rocks? Would rocks help here? Yeah, you must recharge. Because rock wrecker is going to make you recharge. Okay, rock slide did. Rock slide was nice. Cross is that? I'm a, I'm a rock type. I'm one of the most defensive types there is. You can't hit me with physical attacks. Unless it's fighting. Then you can hit me with physical attacks. And a Blossom. I have to switch. Firefox, go. Magical Leaf. That does nothing cool. Okay, now I can Flamethrower and you will... You should start dying. I'm not worried about it. I'm not worried about this. I'm worried more about Brendan, really. I'm going to have a lot of trouble with Brendan's team, probably. But I like my team. It's not bad. I just need to figure out, like, situations like fairy types. I need to find my ways to deal with fairy types. I don't have... I guess maybe my de if we're dealing with fairy types is string, and I need to start using string more often. Yeah, I probably should start using string more often. He is my technical starter of this region. Especially since now I'm not actually using uh, the... Oh my god, you crit me! 
Well, down goes Firefox. And you have superpower, so it would be best not bringing in Baller here. I guess Aqua, despite the fact that he's level 65, he's my best shot at this. And I know that Aqua is getting a little overleveled, but I don't mind because there's level 67s here and I need to deal with them somehow. And you have an Emperos. This Emperos could have anything. I'm going to try and get into Baller. Okay, you don't you do have thunder. That's what that proved. But you also could have some moves that deal with baller. Signal beam is not one of those moves that deals with baller. Are you holding some kind of like invisible focus sash? Damn it. You I died because you were holding some kind of invisible focus sash and the earthquake makes you live on one. There we go. Nice work, String. Nice work, String. Pretty annoyed that it lived on one, though. Pretty... Wait, hang on. Item? No. Okay. Again, obvious item does not is not obvious. And up here. Hopefully I can avoid the old man. Oh, damn it, I didn't avoid the old man. Now I have to face the old man. I'm like not in the mood to face old men. Because I am not in the situations where I need you have a Cyndaquil! I mean, I have to go into Aqua, but like... I like Cyndaquil. I mean, if I can make a suggestion to you guys, I'm gonna... Put, I'm gonna put a link in the outro, if I remember correctly, this video. Go over to Ace Trainer Ruby's channel. Um, Advent sorry, Adventure Trainer Ruby channel because uh, me and him are doing a versus, but it's only on his channel that this versus is, is taking place. It's only on his channel uh, because we have plans to do something on my channel as well uh, later on. So I would suggest going uh, looking at that uh, series. We got like one episode out so far. We are trying to record more. We're going to try and have episodes out weekly so you guys can enjoy it. But it should be a really interesting series. We're doing Sacred Gold, Storm Silver. And I've played that. You guys know I've played that game before. It's an amazing game. I will link his channel in the outro of this video. And I will also put it in the description. So if you do watch my outro, you will get to see his channel. You get to click on it. And you can uh, see that video. And I might even... If I remember correctly, I might make a playlist on the channel. I might... Although I really, I really want to give him the views uh, from this, so I really don't know if I'm going to do that. If I'm going to make a playlist on my channel of that LP, because I really want to give him the views, not me take the views from him. Because I made a playlist. Although I could make a playlist, and I, th I think it would add to his views, so it shouldn't be that bad if I did that. You have a Cacton and a Maractus. That's pretty cool. I'm going to probably... Uh, yeah, I'm probably going to... Oh, you don't kill me. You, I took in sunlight, but... You took in sunlight, but you're not trying to kill me. So I get off another ice beam, and you die. There we go. We beat Jenkins. I'm going to have to heal... Uh, heal up. Uh, burn heal, diet, burn heals, please. I have full heals, I have full heals. I don't need to worry about burn heals when I have full heals. And now I need to revive everyone that is dead. And I probably could use those ethers too. Because I'm not in the best situations move-wise this moment in time. 
Especially on the Arc, especially on Aqua. Um, up. And there you go. And and I think the Aqua you can have an Ether on Ice Beam and on Dazzling Gleam. Everything else should be fine. Uh, yep. Yeah. Everything else is fine. No one needs any. Yeah, no one needs anything else. It's just those two moves. I'm trying to avoid as many trainers as I can so I can come back off screen and uh, deal, deal with them. That's what I'm trying to do anyway. Ooh. Item. Max Revive. Uh, that's kind of useful. Kind of useful. Not great, but kind of useful. Is up here an option? Or is this just for an item? It's just for an item. No, oh, it's TM52 Focus Blast. That's not a bad move. It misses a lot, but it's not a bad... It's not a bad move, and I wouldn't mind uh, teaching that to somebody. Really? Please say you're going to move after you face me, because now I'm not sure how I'm going to get off these stairs otherwise. Garboda. Baller. This is an actual fight that you can do something in. But this is poison. Toxic. Oh. It's okay, Baller. Um... Use Earthquake and destroy uh, destroy this thing, please. Oh, weak armor. Okay, weak armor lowers his defense but active, uh, raises speed. And it didn't kill. Um, I don't like how... Ooh. Okay, you explode. That's an exploding power garbage. Okay. I was not expecting that. I was not expecting an exploding pile of garbage. Oh, you you have a girder now. Ooh, I got the rock climb. I got the rock climb confuse. I'm gonna have to switch. But I got the rock climb confuse. That's pretty cool. Go Firefox. Can you hit yourself? Good, I got Firefox in correctly then. And now I can Psy Shark, and this Girder should go down. Oh, the Girder didn't go down. The Girder steps out of confusion, the Girder uses superpower. Ow! Will you stop doing that? Super powerful moves. Die! Okay. Coverage is not always the best thing. I think I'm going to have to leave this episode off here. Hitmonlee. I can handle the Hitmonlee. Ooh, your squike is especially defensive too. Reversal, I'm dead. Great. Um, go Jake. And use uh, Aerial Ace. There we go. Okay, I'm okay now. Go Jake. Jake is doing well. And you have a C dot. Well, I'm going to just keep going area ways. C dot. Who the hell are you trying to fool with a C dot? And a uh, delusion, which is another one of those ones that's kind of forgotten about from the fifth gen. Okay, I'm not allowed to heal, apparently. Don't really care. You can die now. There we go. Nice work, Jake. Now, please, move. Off the stairs is what I wanted you to do. 
not further up the stairs. I wanted you to move off the stairs so I could move on to the stairs and actually get off the stairs myself. Okay. I mean, at least you're moving. It's not like some trainers when you're, when you're blocked into a situation, they don't move. This is a moving trainer, which is good. I'm going to use one of my max revives since I have three of them. I have to wait until you're off the stairs. Um, thank you. Thank you for moving. Now, nah, can I go this way? No. I have to fit. Do I have to face you? I have to face you. Okay. I have to face you. Because you made yourself unblockable. Alright, fine. What do you have for me? You're going to have four Pokemon. But you start with a jump off. I'm not worried about that. I'm not worried about your jump off. Oh, your jump off sprung up into the air. Uh, let me do something about your jump off springing up into the air. Go, Shocks. Yeah, Shocks can handle that. Shocks takes us all day. Now, if we Mega Thunderbolt. That should do a serious amount of damage to the jump off, right? Even though you are not... I mean, you're only, like, two times a week to my electric move because grass resists. Okay. You're uh, resorting into a switching out situation. That's fine. I mean, I'm still a mega evolution. And you're still just a Growlithe. But you have Outrage. I, honest, I honestly forget that Outrage is a move that Growlithe can learn. I honestly forget that most of the time. Like, why do most, why do people not run Outrage on the, uh, why do people not run Outrage on Arcanine? Because that's a very scary move to deal with. Wow, you like have all of the outrage. You have all of the outrage, and I'm now there. Uh, and now Shocks is very much dead because you have all of the outrage. I mean, at least I might be faster than you, so I can get off a superpower. Wow, you live a superpower, and you get off the outrage again. How do these things keep on living? I know that I'm like under leveled with uh, some, most of my mons, but still, they should not live. I'm using super powerful moves. And now you know to bring in a Pokemon that's going to kill me. Let me just switch out. Because I'm not letting you kill. I'm not letting you kill me. I'm not letting you kill me. I'm not letting you kill Bola. Poison jab. Die. Okay. Jump bluffs are scary. Jump bluffs are annoying. And, and annoying is not cool. And one more mon. What is it? It's a little ducklet. You know what? I'm going to end. I'm going to kill this ducklet and end this episode. And off screen, I'm going to go and face all. I'm going to go... Back to the town. I'm going to fly back to the town. Heal up. And face all the trainers that I missed. Yeah. I'm going to do that. There we go. Okay. So I'm going to end off this episode here. We made it quite far into the... Uh, we made it quite far into the... Um, into Mount Epsilon. I mean, we're not fully at the top yet, but we'll get there. We'll get there. It's going to take more than one episode, sadly. I was hoping it would take... I hope it was going to take one episode. I really did. But uh, it was a good adventure. We had a lot of... I've had a lot of fun making this episode. I'm a little annoyed by it, but I'm, I had a lot of fun making it. I'm going to fly back, uh, get everyone back up to full health, full moves, and then do some well-needed grinding. Because I feel like I'm going to need it. And we have a lot of trainers that are going to be able to uh, 
I'm going to be able to deal with. So I will do that off screen. So if you did enjoy today's episode of the Pokemon Zeta Randomized Bravery Run Challenge, you can leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If you're on YouTube, if you're on VidMe, you can leave an upvote, you can comment, and you can follow the channel as well. Go and check out a mate, uh, the Adventure Trainer Ruby uh, and his and my uh, a, uh, versus. That's only got one episode so far, but more is coming. Believe me, more is coming. It's a really good series. I'm quite enjoying it. You might have to deal with some sound uh, glitches uh, to start off with, but then again, it's our first series. For it's my it's my first verses with him. It's his first verses where he's doing all the editing and stuff like that. So we're learning. It's a process. It's not fully crisp and clean, but like it's very good. And you'll enjoy it. And it will be crisp and clean if we keep the series going. Because we'll learn stuff. And I haven't done a lot of competitive... I haven't done a lot of cooperative work. So I need to work with others to get my craft up when it comes to working with others. Anyway, so until next time, I'm Joseph Games. And I am out. See you again.